Alright, thank you cyclist. Alright, post work. I have an appointment with Mirko. I'm really curious to know Mirko's opinion about uh, Strava. So tomorrow is new bike. No, sorry, Saturday is new bike day. Stay tuned. Yes, it's a secret. But now I have a question for you. What? Tell me your opinion about uh, Strava. Strava made a bad move because uh, something free that you gave to the community should stay. You cannot take take it back without any reason. I completely agree. So if you know any good alternative, let us know in the comments. This is the place where we ride. What a wonderful landscape. Over there, there is Garda Lake. Honestly, I agree with Mirko and I think that uh, Strava made a wrong strategy. I have to add uh, a point because uh, all we know that uh, big data are the oil of the future. And uh, referring this uh, point to Strava, I think that uh, we are giving our data to Strava for free. And that's okay until the app is free. But now, doubt this. I give you something, you give me something. I give you my data, you give me the app for free. They pretend to have a, a huge community ready to pay. They want to get their data for free. I think this is not uh, fair. I think that uh, this Strava strategy could generate a good situation among the amateurs. So the people can ride without the stress of the segments, of the ranking, etc. Finally, people will ride just to enjoy their own ride. Okay, this one was a fast ride after work. I show to Mirko a new uphill for him, that is San Ciriaco, near Negrar, in the middle of Valpolicella. I'll leave you the link in the description to download the GPX file. See you to the next video. Bye bye, guys.